Hello everybody and welcome back to Garden Flipper. Yes, I still haven't cut this one. Apparently that is a bit of a bug that the, the grass grows back. Um, I don't think it's meant to. But someone was saying in my comments that it actually like redid their in it reset their entire thing here, their entire room. Uh, at least my room is looking pretty nice, you know. Gosh. It does look nice. I wouldn't mind living there. I wouldn't mind living here. It'd be lovely. Anyway. <laughs> I'm just like, why can't we find a place to live? It's so bad. Anyway, what were we going to do? We were going to, um... We were going to tell lies to this person's mom, weren't we? <laughs> Mommy left for a few months. When she returns, I will tell her the flowers rotted because I watered them too often. So we're going to accept that and we're going to make his garden of... Oh, look at all the flowers. Oh no, if I got to, if I really got to take away all these lovely flowers. Well, that definitely shows you what can be achieved. But wow. Oh no, she said... Uh, right, right, sorry, he said... Or she said... Oh, I don't, I don't actually know who that is. But they said... They said... To remove the flowers out the back. So... And then put fruity bushes in. So I need to remove all the weeds. Of all these things. Do they all count, all count as weeds? Or... Do we have to get rid of all the flowers? I'll get rid of the weeds anyway, at least. Because they look a bit bad. I know, I'm picking them all up by hand, but I feel like that's the best way to do this. Apparently there are still weeds. Oh, I see them hiding there. Oh, those are weeds too. Okay. Sometimes it's hard to tell which ones are weeds and which ones are not. I think I have a skill point there. So I'll have to go and have a little look at that. So that's the garden kind of tidied up. Uh, but we still have weeds somewhere. Are you weed? Are all of these plants counting as weeds? I don't know. Mow the lawn. The lawn looks pretty mowed to me. I mean, maybe not. I don't know. Doesn't look like it's really long grass or anything. I have removed 6% of all the weeds. Maybe I would be better with my weed whacker, actually. Oh, am I allowed my brush cutter? That's my weed whacker, right? Doesn't generally allow me to cut down things that aren't meant to be cut down, you see. And it mows the lawn a little bit as well. I don't know, it, say, it said mow the lawn. Well, I'll just mow what I can see that's long. So this is just the little tidy up procedure that we have to do at the beginning of every Garden Flipper episode. Like I say, it's the equivalent of, of cleaning up and get, getting rid of the cockroaches in the house and stuff. I love the fact that there is actually an option to change the cockroaches to cut glass. For people that are squeamish, which is not me. I'm not squeamish about anything, so it's cool. So you guys will just have to avert your eyes while I clean them up with the vacuum cleaner. It's so satisfying. Okay, so I think most of the lawn mowing is around this area, by the looks of it. Because it's like 60% done now. I was going to say, it did look really short around the other side. And I was like, I'm sure that's already been mown. I still don't have a lawn mower, by the way, guys. This is going to be terrible. I'm going to have to hire like a really high-powered one or something to try and like... Because the lawn's going to be so long. It's going to be terrible. 91%. No, no. Must be 100%. Still 91%. Still 91%. Oh, no.
trying to find all the little bits of grass that I probably missed. I like the little bits of dirt that you miss as well, you know. We're in 94%, so there'll be some there'll be some grass somewhere hiding from me. Hiding. Hiding grass. Where are you? Ah, oh, there. It's 96. There'll be some more somewhere. There you. I just see you there. Ninety-seven. That one there. Okay, well, I'm going to go into my tablet. And I'm going to go and see about all these uh, points. I've got loads of points, look. Loads of points. So, I want to put them into gardening. Because I do. Reset all of my points, so... Oh, no, it hasn't. No, it hasn't. Look, they're all unlocked, see? All of these. The white ones are unlocked. High grass visible on the mini-map. That sounds like a really good one for the particular problem I am having just now. Visible weeds on the mini-map. Also sounds very good. The upgraded shovel for plaster fa plaster fast planting <laughs> faster planting faster digging and uh, oh yeah yeah let's get those let's not worry about the moles for now next time I get a uh, a point we'll get the moles the shovel and the unfolding grass. New perk after 13 minutes of mowing time, 32 planted plants or 250 weeds removed or 7 mole rats eliminated. They must be tough to do then. If you only have to have 7 of them. So mowing the lawn, I mean there's there might be some lawn around here that's maybe a bit long or something. There's a few weeds, definitely. Those need to go. Stinging nettles, we don't want any of those. Doing a good job now. Oh yes. We have only removed 47% of weeds. Um, I'm just looking at this mini map now to see how it shows up the weeds and the long grass. All right, I see. I see this long grass now. Doing that on the mini map is so much better than trying to do that on, what? Why won't that one go? I can see it on the mini map. Right in front of me here. There it goes. So yeah, I can see all this long grass now. I couldn't even see it without the mini map. That's all done. gone see this this is the this is the issue here there's a lot of like dappling and shade and stuff that makes it really hard to see what I'm doing so I'm having to basically use the mini map to try and work out where all this long grass is that I'm missing in the corner there oh I think I think the mowing is done now Technically a little bit over here. A tiny bit there and there. So it was just around these trees. It was a little bit uh, a little bit of grass there that I didn't wasn't able to see. Right now let's um try and find out where these weeds are. Right, so there's a big patch back here by the looks of it. Let's get the weed whacker out. Let's get all of those gone. So that's so much easier with that showing me where they all are. In my garden, I can see where they all are. Very easily. In the patio! Okay, so we've got 93% of all the weeds now. There's a couple down here, look. 
that I had missed. 97%. Let's just keep running around until we find the last bits. There's some here in, in this little patch. Right, so there we go. So we're doing well here. So we've done all of the removal of the weeds, I think. Have we? Or we no, we're nearly there though. There's a couple back here. That's weird. I didn't see them. Aha, you count as weeds, apparently. Where's, where's uh, there's one right here somewhere. That all the weeds? No, still some more to go. Are you a weed? Are you a weed? Are you a weed? I mean, it did say get rid of all the flowers around the back. Technically. <laughs> I mean, I didn't quite realise that the weed whacker would do quite as much there, but uh, okay, cool. So we want lots of fruit around here. Fruity trees, and this is supposed to be like a, a place for fruity bushes and things. Do I get rid of all the flowers? We did say to do that. So I am just going to do that. Because I'm mean. So we'll leave all the ones around the front, apparently. That's mommy's area. Let's get rid of all of this and give myself a bit more room for planting. It's nothing to do with me enjoying just using the weed whacker loads. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I know, those look so pretty as well. I'm going to leave those. They're quite pretty, aren't they? Everyone's like, no, don't cut down all those beautiful flowers. I'm just going to leave those three because I like the look of them. I don't seem to be able to really remove that. Um, these guys. Yeah, I don't like these guys. These, these can go. Bye. Making this into a bit of a more modern garden. I don't like these either. They look a little bit rubbish, honestly. And so do these. I don't like those. And uh, they can go. Right. And those can go. So the ones that kind of look a bit more wild have gone. I've, I've left a couple of patches of, of stuff there. Okay, so we need to do two corner something or others. I can't even see what it's saying I need to do. Ribus. Ribus. <laughs> I don't know what. All right, let's have a look at my, um... Oh, they're the buyer's perks. I can't actually see properly on my tablet what the, what the quest is. So, um, I'll have to hope that I can find what I need to plant. So, Cornus, meh, Cornus Mass something or other. Cornus Mass, okay. By many of these, so there's but there needs to be a couple of these trees then, don't there? So I can make this kind of a nice little area here. So I'll put one there, and maybe one over here. Find a nice spot for it. Oh, let me come backwards and see where it's going. Yeah, I like that. I like that. So that's making this into like a really nice little sort of secluded area. You could maybe put a chair here or something. I like that. It's good. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do. Do you know what I'm thinking though? I'm thinking I should put everything down before I plant it all in. That that would be a good way to plan it, wouldn't it? Yeah. So the next one was what? Canomelis something or other. I can't say plant names to save my life. That one. Oh, okay, that's not too bad. So I need three of those. Or they can just go like wherever. They can just sort of pop in for here. Yeah. So we're just making like a really like nice round shape in here. I, I quite like this area actually. So that's three of those. And they're three ribus something or other. 
I hope that will just come up. Because it's a bit rubbish that I can't see the whole name. Mm, okay, so they're quite easy. And I can have ones with like slightly brighter black. Yeah, I'll have the ones with the red flowers on because they look slightly brighter. I need something to brighten it all up. Pop one there, I think. Um, maybe one over here, get a bit of... Oh man, I thought I was buying many there. One maybe around that area, and maybe one just here. There's not really a way into this area now. Um, put a second one there. Oh, I don't like that placement at all. I think what I want to do is place that there. I want to move this one over here a bit. Oh yeah, so we've got my like circle garden going on here. No, no, I don't think that's right there either. I think we need a, like a bit of a wait in people to go so I'm kind of thinking I'll plant it here and just make that little round corner that yeah, yeah yeah my little circle okay cool so I reckon once I planted those will be good and I like the way that I like the way that's gone personally this is a very personal thing and I'm sure there's people there's people telling me oh you should have used your space better and knocked down walls and done all this and that and the other I'm like, nah, I like it the way I did it, thanks. <laughs> it's just, just my thing. That's water! Water, all the fruit trees. Yay, planting successful. I get to the point in my life now where I just like what I like, and that's it. And if other people don't like it, then when it's something like interior design, it's like, well, I'm not an interior designer. If I was designing your house, then obviously we would have to have a big conversation about what's going on. But otherwise, it's cool. So yeah, look, it looks all shady and cute. Like a little sort of shady area to put things in. I like it. I like it a lot. You could definitely drink a non-alcoholic mocktail out here. Yep. Or if you are over 18. You could even have one with some alcohol in it. <laughs> there we are. It's looking nice, actually. This looks like... It looks almost like a conservation area, in a way. Like, you know when you just, like, plant something... I mean, we didn't leave the grass long, and that's obviously the, the first thing you need to do for a conservation area, actually. Long grass is really good for animals and, and little bees and and insects and things like that to live in, grasshoppers, that sort of thing. But other than that, it does, it looks like a little tiny conservation area over here and I like it. I like what I'm doing. It's nice because the last one I did, I didn't really 100% like how it turned out. But I think as I get more experience with the game, it will start to, yeah. It'll, I'll start to be able to like work out where I'm planting things a bit more easily. I won't make silly mistakes like that mistake with the gravel I made in the first episode. That was a bit silly. And that was just that I didn't know to read the uh, the instructions. It's not a mistake I'll make again. Because bear in mind that when I do these things, a lot of the time I don't practice. I don't have time to practice. I just go for it. I do blind. You see, you see, you see me at my worst in a way, but also at my funniest probably. <laughs> you see all my mistakes, and you see the real me rather than the the polished perfect me. And that is on purpose. Because I don't feel that showing the highlight reel is a good way to be in a, in a way because I feel like it just makes people think that you have to be perfect all the time. And you do not. Especially when you're playing games. Games are 
games are a thing for you to enjoy and love and that's why I do what I do because I play games to enjoy them and to love them and to have fun doing them not to be perfect because I'm not a perfect person no one is there we are so it's my little my little round area that's so cool I love the way that's turned out it's kind of almost accidental but it's like my little I could plant a few more little tiny plants around here but that's done basically now as far as the commission is concerned but we're still not completely done. So over here, we have a task of planting some uh, more trees. And I think some trees along the fence line might be quite nice here. So we need one medium pear, two plums and two cherry. I think the pear tree would go in first. Let's go pear. And I definitely do think typing Oh, was it a large pear tree? Oh, let's see. No, it was a medium pear tree. Typical. Get back in a tablet and go back to a medium pear tree. Didn't realise there would be like loads of different types, so I got a little caught out there. So what I'm thinking is to have the pear tree maybe about here. Um, and then maybe put like some cherry trees either side along the fence line. And then maybe we could like, um... Ooh, so this is the grape area. I could maybe put a couple of trees up against the wall, although that's not good design, by the way. It's not good design at all. And the reason that's not good design is because the roots will go under the wall and undermine it. But maybe in a game that doesn't matter so much. So let's get the cherry trees and see how big they are. Medium, I imagine, again. Okay, it looks like we're not getting anything in behind that patio. We could get them in the patio. I wonder how that would end up looking. Um, maybe not so great. What I could do is put them either side of the patio here, which would look quite nice. To do that though, I may need to get rid of this. I know, I really liked it, but I think a tree there would be better. So I'll keep the, I'll keep its friends. And then we'll go in and get an, a second cherry tree. I'll pop it just there. You see what I'm doing there? And then we can have uh, the plum trees either side of the pear tree, I think. Plum. Really? Plum tree. There we are, that's better. I was like, why is it not giving me plum trees? It's because there's too many other things in the way, so... Maybe I'll pop one about here. Um, hopefully that's kind of in line. And then one... Oh, I wish I had a grid or something. Looking on the mini-map, I think about there, but I'll just hang back and see if they look kind of in line. I think so. I think they look pretty good. Make sure that. Oh, are we still? Uh, no, ah, no. I might have to put another cherry tree in somewhere, but I really like the idea of having the cherry trees on each side there. So we'll plant them, and then we'll see what happens. I might have to put another one somewhere else in the garden. But that's not the end of the world. I'm allowed to put some extra things in to make it look good, right? Put the soil around, give it some water. This is this is what I would do with my garden if I had like my own home. I would do so much stuff. 
I would plant, I would buy plants, I would really enjoy gardening. Also if I had time as well, more time and my own home. Need a bit more water? I think it's done. So there we are, that's my, my little trees outside my patio area. I just think that's like a good look. So, oh, I did count as the cherry trees being planted though, even though it was slightly in a different area to what it had asked for. It still seemed to pick it up, that's good. The hole is now dug. Put soil around. And give it a spray. I love how it comes to life when you spray it. It's really cool. And a little pear tree. Not sure I would have so many fruit trees in a garden though. The reason for that is that you then have to deal with all the fruit. Maybe have something a little easier. Lovely. Gosh, I wonder what lighting options they've got. Ooh, I love putting pretty lights in a garden. It's always cool. It's always nice to have like a day into night sort of thing going on and also inside to outside. There we are, that's lovely. I like that. I like that a lot. Well, this garden's kind of looking cool now. So what else can we do? Plant another medium pear tree? But I just did that. Ah, it hadn't quite been watered enough. All right then, that's all done. Now you should run around the garden and see what other tasks there are for me. La 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 la, la 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 la. Am I saying this is the overall progress? So is there something I've missed? Done all the fruity bush tasks. Done all the garden tasks. Well, it looks to me like it's all been done, but... Oh, I know, yes, I haven't done the grapes. Yes, 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 yes. Bacchus grapes, but I, I was like, I know there must be something that I haven't done, and I, I knew about that as well, but I just forgot. So, Bacchus grape! Why many? So we need to put 10 in, apparently. I'm trying to think of a nice way to put these in. Because I can either be sympathetic with what's there already, which I'm tempted to do, actually. Oh gosh, that's really out of line. Okay, that looks quite sweet. Honestly, it's this one that's more out of line than anything else. Okay, they look pretty good now. So that's eight of them. I'm actually just going to pick that, pick that up. Oh, I could just put it somewhere else. Okay, nice. So I could just rearrange the entire garden. That's quite nice. And then we'll get two more of those Bacchus grapes in in line with these. Not 100% in exactly the right place, but they're pretty good. Mm -hmm. 
I should put them all in and then water them all at the end, shouldn't I? Because then I can go all the way across and it'll be really fun and cool, right? Yes. Ow, cramp in my foot. Ow, 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 ow. Anyone else ever get that? Like, you, you, you like just curling your toes a little bit and then your foot goes, yow! Probably like some deficiency in my diet or something. Probably some old wives tale to do with that, no doubt. Where did it go? Ah, oh, there you are. Oh. Well, I can like just dig all the holes and then insert all the plants and then plant all the plants. I can do it like a conveyor belt. I have a lot to do here, you see. A lot of planting. This is where I end up introducing a bug by not playing this the way it's intended. I'll just do this section and then I'll move on to the other section in a second. So this is all my grapevines. All going in. There they are. And then we're going to put the soil around on all of them. And we're going to water all of them. It can be sometimes a little hard to exactly get uh, get it lined up for the put soil around command. To have it exactly on that little tree trunk there. Okay, let's go. Meow. That was fun. Okay, uh, we've got these four to do over here as well. So, plant. Oh, I have to dig the hole. Okay. It's weird, it's not letting me plant this one. Oh well. I'll do it the other way, it's fine. I don't mind. Why won't you let me plant you? Let me plant that one. That brush cutter away. I'm just going to move it back into the position, the exact position it was in before. No, it does not want me to plant it. Well, that is rather frustrating. Pressing E everywhere. Nope. Let's see if I pop it like a bit further along, if it will. Nope. Do I have to water this one first? Apparently it'll let me apparently it'll let me water them over there. Let me put it out. I'm sorry that I tried to do things in the wrong order. How dare I? Okay, I'll put them back over here and I'll see if they will now allow me to plant them. They will! I am bad human. We're trying to plant things in wrong order. The nymphs of the wood. <laughs> the nymphs of the wood. The goddess of the the trees oh that one's not planted very evenly me so they had so much trouble oh well not a lot i can do now i've planted it is there or is there can i move it slightly with my hand i was able to move other things apparently that one still needs watering a bit okay so that's plant that's successfully planted so if I go to my hand, can I then move it the same way I can the flowers? No. So I would have to like dig that up. And to be honest, it's not far enough out for me to worry about that too much. 
I'm gonna plant this one and then I'll see if I can plant the one in between. If I can move it around enough. Doesn't seem too happy with me, honestly. Uh, what terrible trouble we are having here. Okay, so that one's successfully planted. So I'm just gonna move this one around. See if I can get it to successfully plant as well. Maybe if I just very slightly move it over. Yeah, there we are. Might not be quite in the right place, but oh well. I'll take what I can get now. Pretty garden! 100% complete! I really like how that looks. I'm gonna just take a little picture on my tablet of this garden. Where's my camera gone? Yeah, pretty! New photo saved! Oh then. Does it look prettier from this angle though? I think good angles. No, no. It's definitely prettier from the angle I took it. So I think we should just turn this in and then go and do something else. I might actually get two orders completed today. Yes, yes. Okay. Let's see if we've got any other garden orders. Hopefully we do. Put my garden in order. Or one little thing to complete my part of heaven. Which one shall we do then? Um. Okay, so sadly my business trip. Go away, email. Good grief. Sadly my business trip takes longer than expected. I should be back home by the end of the week. I just need some rest when I get back. And I think that the mess in my garden might make me nervous. I want to hire your company again to put my garden in order. And oh, please take care of the lawn. It hasn't been mowed in ages. That just sounds like a tidy up. You know what? That might be good because we've already spent like 40 minutes like doing that other garden. So just a little quick tidy up one might be quite nice. So we need to cut the grass and, and do the weeds. And that's it. So we're just going to have a good old fun time with the weed whacker for 10 minutes. Oh, so much fun! So they were asking the other day, what do people want in this game? And everyone's like, I want a lawnmower! You, you, you made it this long for us to be able to actually cut the grass. Now we've got to do it with a strimmer. Are you kidding me? <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. This is so fun. Yeah. <laughs> look, at, look at the mini-map. <laughs> I'm not being very neat at all, it's hilarious. I'll go neaten up the edges in a minute though. We're just getting the, the majority of it done. Get away weeds! It's totally fun doing this. Love it. I love a good tidy. I love like sometimes I love just taking the commissions for the houses where I just clean them. And you guys are then like, do viscera cleanup detail. I did a viscera cleanup detail on stream and got 100% on it. Because I have to find every little bit. I'm terrible. I'm like, is it 100% yet? No, there's a bullet hole I haven't found. That means I haven't cleaned up a bullet somewhere. I'm certainly not speed running it or anything, but uh, I certainly do a thorough job. I like to take my time with things. Get all the stuff around this tree done. Ah, oh, lovely stuff. I wonder how much I get paid for this. Super therapeutic. Guys, if you, if you just want something really therapeutic to do, I was a little bit stressed today because, you know, I'm worrying about obviously the fact that I've got six weeks to find a new house or uh, we're in a bit of trouble. But... I was, I was getting a bit stressed about it, but then I came to play this, and it's like, 
just get and mow lawns and 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 it's very simple it's a very simple task to do it's like a simple way i think that's quite a good way of like relieving anxiety a little bit of you know or worry with me it's not really anxiety it's more just worry but for relieving that like to do to do a simple problem that you can easily fix kind of helps you feel better a little bit about the problems in your life that you can't fix and this little garden being a total mess is a problem that i can easily fix and it's lovely i do need to go out and do the same in my garden while well, i still have it ah beautiful lovely stuff right we've still got a few scrappy bits around here we need to get all the scrappy bits I can see them all on the mini map, you see. It's a little bit like the bits of the invisible bits of dirt that used to show up sometimes. You have to go and get them. There's loads under that bush, you see. I wouldn't be able to see that normally. So that's where the mini map stuff comes in super handy. I have another skill point now as well, so I'll be able to see mole hills. I might keep the point though. So if I do get a commission where I have mole hills to, to clear, I'll take the mole hill point. But if I have something else where I think it would be more useful to have like a spade or something for that particular one, because I usually I get at least one skill point per thing I do. Skill points aren't too difficult to get in this. Lovely. Maybe they get all the little, little rough patches. Come here, you. All the little bits I missed. There's some bits down there. Bits behind that bush there. Some bits over here. But it's around this bush too. It's getting to the point though where I'm like, is that a bit of grass or is that just a speck on my screen? That one was a bit of grass. You can tell because it moves. So just making sure it's a nice tidy job and then I'll get this uh, bit around the back all done as well. Nice and tidy. Mm. That bit wouldn't go away then. I was like, no. Come back here. I've got a little bit down there that's just a little, needs a bit of a tidy. And a bit down there, and a bit down there, and a bit up there, and a bit along the side of the house. I think it has two lengths as well that it goes to. So sometimes you get like the long grass and then you get the sort of half cut grass. Like if you had your lawnmower on like six or seven, you know? I, yeah, assuming that all lawnmowers are like my lawnmower. Which are probably not. My dead lawnmower. This is looking nice now. Just a little bit around here though, so let's grab that. Oh, I see it. It's like it's a little track there. Gra grab that one. From now I can finish the incomplete order. No, I'm not going to leave this grass unmowed. What kind of heinous criminal would do that sort of thing? What kind of villain, what kind of scoundrel. Would take on a job to cut the lawn and then go don't worry don't worry about paying me quite as much but i didn't actually finish the job like would you ever have a guard in the back that did that to you you'd be like no come and finish it it's like i hired a gardener once and um i was like you need to put weed killer down and you need to like do all of the the lawn and, and do all of the tidying up it was i think before we moved out of a house or something and um and they didn't do the weed killer because it was too wet or something. And I, I had to withhold payment until they came back and did it. I was like, I'm not paying you until you come back and do the weed killer. 
And they were like, oh, well, I guess we'll do it. But they would have taken payment and then not done the job. So I refused to pay them. I was like, no, you do the job, I will pay you. But they were all like, they sent me the invoice and they were like, you got two weeks to pay it. I'm like, you haven't finished. <laughs> ah. Yes, I'm not someone to be trifled with generally. I've worked in enough like customer service jobs and things like that, that I kind of know how to complain. It's really bad sometimes as well, because you feel like it's not a nice way to be. You don't want to be the person that's complaining, but at the same time, you don't want to be the person that gets ripped off because you didn't. And the majority of people are lovely, honest people, and they don't want to rip you off. And there's just a few little, like I say, scoundrels out there who want to charge you and not put your weed killer down. Oh, apparently that's completed. No, it's not. It's not completed at all. Look, there's two patches of grass still there. I need to get them done. Oh, there we are. And this one here. Now I think we're done. We'll have a quick run around the garden and make sure it's all completely done. <gasps> There's some um, patches over here. This is the most neatly trimmed lawn in the world. Bree Vanderkamp would be proud. There we are. Lovely. I think we're done. Take a photo of my beautifully trimmed lawn. Oh, it's M to take a photo. Oh, yeah, cool. Oh, there's all my photos. That's my gallery. New photo save. I can see it in my gallery there. I can see the one I took of the, the cherry trees and stuff. That'll need to be brightened up before it can be a thumbnail though. Yeah. So that was really cool. So how much money did we get for mowing the lawn? I want to see. We got 300 and... What? That was rubbish. Okay. I shall complete it. So that was clearly like an an early game one so that was fine i mean it took like less maybe about 10 minutes to do so i think that's not too bad for 350 but um yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna leave you guys now and i'm gonna go and mow the lawn outside my office even if i just do a patch of it and then i'm gonna see whether the next time i log in whether it's still saved it or not so we'll have to see but that's it for garden fluffer for today i hope you enjoyed and if you did then please do leave me a like below if you'd like to see more please subscribe i'll let you know when the videos are out i hope to see you next time in the meantime though please look after yourselves and keep being awesome